Hello adventurers, there have been a few new players around here and I'm grateful for that. So to show off the variety in characters we play, let's look at how you can customize a better character sheet to be the best one for you. If you don't have it yet, it has become even easier. Now, when you click the link in the video description, you see one option. One button for all the versions and all the languages. When prompted, just enter the amount you wish to pay. You can just put a zero in there if you don't have any copper to spare or you just want to check it out. I completely understand. Just put a zero in there and then hit I want it. Next, type in your email. Wait a couple seconds and you'll see a brand new index page. From here, you can choose the version you want to use. And there are also some guides should you have any issues. With the link in your email, you'll always have access to this index that updates with every contribution. Now let's open up the English US paper version and that creates a prompt for you to make a copy. That magically creates a better character sheet in your Google Drive. And that is all yours to customize. And the first thing you see here is a little quality of life improvement. How to troubleshoot certain things, links to some guide videos, and a bunch of little tools that you may or may not want to use, including a clickable checkbox. And then in the tabs down below are all the pages you might want to use. Some of you already know the caster page, but now we have a whole separate area just for your spells, components, and spell scrolls. What else could you want? Well, if there is still something you desperately need, simply create it. You actually use Electrum? Well, maybe get rid of the rations, move things over, and you have a space for your weird precious metal. Alignment? How about we put it up here instead of wait? Because when does that ever come up during the game? You're still many campaigns away from having a 9th level spell, but you do want to list your prepared spells. Suit your needs and change it up. Select everything and adjust the borders. And then use the additional space for your personality traits. Just copy a box from up here and type it in. Traits, ideals, bonds, flaws. Generally, the text size should be 8, but my perception is also pretty high. Oh, and you also want to keep track of your key points? Maybe put them up here. If the font gets mixed up, just go up here and choose Merryweather, and then go to the front page and copy the symbol you want to use. Double click in the space and copy, copy, copy. You could also put them somewhere else if you'd like to. Remember to make it your own. You could just make this whole area blank. It is all up to you to be the space for the information you need most during the game. And that is why I made this in Google Sheets, to make it as easy to customize for as many people as possible. For example, if you're in the camp that prefers skills sorted alphabetically, go ahead and do so. Then use the free space for a character portrait. Just combine the cells and insert image. How cool is that? You could also add some color or even some emojis. On Windows, hit Windows and period or Control Command Space on macOS. And the same is true for all the other pages. Just because it says abilities or personality up here doesn't mean you can't just use it to create more space for your spells, inventory, or questionable literature. Every character has their own areas of interest. But all you want is the character page and one more for your spells. We can make that too. The last two tabs are single pages that are ready to print. And you can make any page single page. Simply select the area you don't need and delete the cells and print that. But that is a bit destructive, so let's undo that. Instead, you can also highlight one side, go to print and change the print area to selected cells. Make sure the orientation is portrait, adjust the margins to your printer and print it. Et voila! Two pages with everything you need in the same size that you are used to. I hope this makes your game a little bit better and a little bit more fun. If you think there is still something missing or something to improve, do let me know. And most of all, I would love to see what you make out of this. So share an image with me on Reddit or Instagram. 
whatever is your favorite social gathering place. And with that, I'll cast Thaumaturgy to applaud all your adventures.